Okay, let's assume we're going to be speaking a little more quickly now. I usually get very excited and I start uh, pushing these sorts of things on people. My name is Steve McRae, and I'm here to help you fix your school and get your kid in a great university. Now, um, there's another aspect of Litke's work, which is creating a portfolio. Every kid writes 75 pages of his life. He creates a life story. He does this by interviewing a lot of people. He can do uh, uh, the interview on video and then edit the video together, or he can um, interview people and write down their stories. In some way, he's, the goal is to get about 75 pages together, and it takes about two years to do this. Um, these are all aspects of the Litke method. Now, another thing he does is he puts a lot of questions on the wall in the classrooms. There, there are five key questions, which you can find by going to metcenter.org. But then, after you take those questions, there are spin-off questions. So, um, in developing your classrooms, yeah, I mean, you can try to fix your school, but basically what you're going to have to do is try to make the school look as much like a Litke school as possible. You can go onto the internet, you can go to youtube.com forward slash visual and active. And what you will find are two videos showing the Dennis Litke School, Big Picture Schools. On those videos, if you record it, if you want to download it, use something called Zamzar, Z-A-M-Z-A-R.com, and you can pull in a, a video. Wouldn't that be great? Well, once you grab that video, guess what you're going to do? You're going to put it onto DVD. You're going to put it onto a VHS. You're going to put it on to um, an audio CD and maybe transfer the sound. You're going to put this video on a CD and then play it with um, some teachers or some students. What you're going to do is you are going to get the information over to other people. That's the goal, because you've got to get your numbers up. Right now, you're a force of one, and you've got to become more than uh, probably, probably closer to about 50. You're going to need at least 50 people on your side to be able to persuade the institution that you've got something worth doing here. And it might be that um, even if you have all of those 50 people, it still won't be enough. So what you're going to do is get all of them thinking the way you are. And so it might take a month to pull these people together, but you're going to have a meeting. You're going to have lots of little meetings, and then you're going to have a big meeting. One of the things you can do is tell the people to look at this video. The series of videos will help them see that it is a long process and a rewarding process. Um, Allison Gopnik, G-O-P-N-I-K, she's at Berkeley. She talks about the teacher as a coach. How many times do we see teachers making mistakes? How many times do students watch a teacher struggling to write uh, a composition, we usually say, here is a composition that I wrote last night. They don't actually see the person struggling. And that's what you've got to see. You've got to see people struggling and how they get over the struggle, how they maintain their focus. And why not keep a journal of your struggles with Fix Your School? Why not you take the time to Document where you felt the stress, where you felt that things weren't going well, where you felt that you had more that you could have done, where you felt that there was a block. All these things that kids go through, 
why don't you write down and show them how you pushed through, embraced your your beast, your dragon, your the the thing that was bothering you, and you, you overcame it through persistence. And so. Um, your second step has been meeting with other parents. And now the third step will be meeting other teachers and the administration. So that's the next video. Visual and active at gmail.com.